Hello, boys and girls, my name is Otto C and welcome back to a brand new series in Minecraft. This series will be a bit different. Uh, the series is called No Sleep Challenge and it focuses a bit more on the uh, uh, survival uh, aspect of the game while the Another Day in Minecraft focuses on uh, building and, uh, and farming. Uh, but here the challenge is to survive and we are in near a river. I think that's something we can deal with. So let's start the game by punching some wood and uh, while doing that I can explain you a bit about the goals of this series. So you know there is the uh, end dragon and uh, once you have defeated the end dragon uh, you get the credits and that can basically be seen as uh, uh, reaching the end of the game and basically that's what we will try to do um, reach the end credits but there is a twist uh, well we can craft a bed and use it to set our uh, spawn point we are not allowed to sleep during the night so this is something that was way easier before the addition of uh, phantoms but um, because then basically you uh, only needed to uh, to stay in a lit area during the night um, but with the uh, phantoms uh, the nights became more difficult so this is something that we need to uh, look at so having a river here is a good thing because uh, eventually we will have to go doing some uh, fishing uh, for uh, XP and uh, good books um, there are ways and basically the easiest way to make progress um, would be to find a village and then basically have a, a village set up um, but it does not always have to be uh, easy so let's prepare ourselves a bit uh, we will harvest quite a bit of wood so that in the end we can have a clear space here at the shore of our river and this should help with uh, uh, spawning uh, mobs and uh, in 1.18 uh, the mobs only spawn in light level 0 whereas before it was uh, light level uh, 7 so this makes lighting up the area quite a bit easier however we are still lacking um, 
some resources to do that. Mainly torches. And ooh, yummy apple. Um, and eventually we will have to uh, dig down. That's the uh, first X. Uh, let's create a new one. Eventually we will upgrade our gear. Um, but I first want to uh, get a bit of uh, stuff here. I hear chicken. Maybe we should also plant some uh, some wheat as actually we will get hungry and need to do something about it. If we are punching some wood, uh, some some grass, we might get some seeds. No. No luck so far. Then we could plant a bit of weed. And that should definitely uh, help. Sure, we can find some better foods later on. Ah, like this. It's been a while since I uh, crafted a hoe. A tiny bit of uh, farm going here, on here, at the front. And then we will pick up these last few trees here at the back and then repair an entry into the hillside. Another thing with this uh, upgrade is uh, that with the uh, increased world height you have quite a bit more flexibility when it comes to uh, vertical building. So, yep. It's the shovel here. And there, have the first stone. that should be able to craft ourselves a bit of stone gear. Then 
let's pick up the crafting bench, our chest, the other one, and then our operations over there. Get this tree out because this one might cause the the leaves from this spawning. Looks like it gets towards night time. Um Um, okay, planks. Let's build ourselves a few doors. All right, uh, then. Just to be safe, stone sword, stone shovel, um, stone pickaxe, and we need a furnace. We pluck that up here, and then we can have. various things to burn so that means all our wood gear is going and we can craft our first torches Yay! Um, let's do it this way. And then we can enlarge the uh, inside here. And then I guess we will prepare to go down. As you can see uh, on this level, we still have light at, and I see it. at six so before 1.18 uh, i would have needed to place way more torches um, so you can now be more sparingly with your light sources which should help uh, creating moody builds it does not particularly help uh, when recording because uh, everything gets a bit darker so uh, probably for your benefit i will have a few more light sources Okay, then let's go down. We need iron, we need coal. Um, and we have hit a huge ravine. Ravine. Because all the way down there's copper. So, 
maybe let's turn here. And go further down. Dirt section. All right, and that pick is almost gone. There it goes. So, yes, it could be one higher, but one thing after the other. Um, probably need a backup pickaxe anyway. The night outside. Um, can burn more tools. I guess with all this mining, we will cut once we are in a situation that is a bit more interesting, for example, actually finding something. There should be uh, some queens or what level are we here at? 40. Still have a bit of a way to go until we reach uh, the new diamond level, which I think is at around minus 90. Uh, minus 90. Uh, it does not go that far down. And I'm out of torches. Uh, what I wanted to say at minus uh, 59. Um, and the last tool. More torches. Ooh, is that a cow? No, that's a birch tree on the other side. Uh, eventually, we will also have to make a fishing rod so we can do this. And fishing. we have reached the um, Couple deep slate or the deep slate level, which is around, which starts at around level zero. So, no caves found, no ores found. Let's go further down. Hey! Redstone, um, but with an iron pick, we need an iron pick for that. So, no use 
combining it with a stone pick. But with the uh, different ore distribution at the different level, I need to look that up, but uh, then we can uh, maybe branch out at uh, different levels down our staircase uh, so we can get to the uh, respective ore that we need. And we are at minus 11, so still a way to go down. And our first diamonds. They are at level minus 15. Seems a bit high. Not have expected finding them so high up. Let's make sure find them out safely later on when we have iron tools. block of ore. Very nice. And there goes our second pickaxe. Uh, and out of torches anyway. So let's head back up and maybe we have another sunrise. It should mean uh, can venture out a bit, maybe find a spider, uh, which could provide us with some string for a fishing rod. But I guess this is it for this first episode. Hope you enjoyed this different format and join me again for the next one. Goodbye!